when I left the cabin that's up in the very top center of the state of Minnesota last fall, I left a few trail cams out on the some of my beaver dam trails and that the animals use a lot because they're forced to walk up in the trail because of the waters of the that are in the beaver pond. And I got some pretty good, very unique animals. In fact, one very rare one for the area to show you. So I thought we'd just take this morning and we're going to review some of the, I won't call it exotic wildlife, but some of the wildlife that are up around that Minnesota cabin that you're just not going to see in most places. I'll try and not jump in and name these animals right away and give you a chance to kind of see what they are. I'll slow this down now so we got more time to point out some things here. Now this is a bobcat. Notice that there's no ear tufts. The feet aren't real big and as he walks look at the tip of the tail. The bobcat has a white tip on the tail and we're going to talk about lynx later and they have a black tip on the tail. Now we're watching my namesake, the Martin. Now these Martins are they're fairly common up there and they're out hunting for uh, red squirrels, snowshoe hares, and the different other mammals and mice that are running around. And you can see how that's one trait they have is they, they like to get up and get a good look around. And then these animals, I've had them in my cabin yard. Uh, they're, they're a ball to watch. I mean, they, the one ran out to my window one time at the door and looked in just like he did here, put his paw in the glass and was looking around inside. And then he made a little loop around. The next thing I know, he was ready to jump into my lap. And I thought, that's not going to be a good thing. So I just said, whoa. I'm going to be showing all of these these mammals running around and unfortunately this cute little snowshoe hare right here is what most of these animals are on the prowl and they're looking for. He unfortunately has the status of being kind of at the wrong spot in the food chain. This fisher would love to have that snowshoe hare for dinner. Surprisingly enough, this is only the second time that I've observed raccoons out around that cabin area. Now what I'm trying to show is, is that this is a bobcat. You can notice that the, the white on the end of his tail is very plain and you can see that his paws aren't real big and we did not see any ear tufts. But what amazed me about this particular bobcat is that striking white coloration, those bands on his ears.
So, pop quiz time. Notice anything different about this animal? This isn't the best shot of it, but if we notice that that black tail and those big feet. That was very nice of this lynx to stop and pose for us. And you can see the, the ear tufts that are so prominent. And look at the size of those feet. That's so that it can run across the top of the snow. And so compared to a bobcat, it's got humongous feet. Now this is a rare animal. They have a pretty good population in northeast Minnesota. But here in north central Minnesota, this is a very rare find. And I was really glad I was able to document it for the Department of Natural Resources. They'll put it in their files and keep track of such an occurrence in this area. This wolf pack is from a few years ago, but it was just too good not to repeat it again here. Through the summer and the fall, there are really no white-tailed deer out in my cabin area. But when the snows build up, the deer know to, to migrate back in there because there's an abundant white cedar, which is a really good wintertime browse for them. Now, I think what's happened here is they had like an ice storm before this, and you can see all that debris laying on top. That's all little bits of white cedar that has fallen on top of that snow. And so that's, I think they're just getting a... They're getting an easy meal here of going along and nibbling on that.
Yeah, I know, this is a really easy one, but how are we doing? Are we naming these animals as they're coming across our screen? <laughs>